Hello everyone. I was in Walmart not too long ago and in the jewelry section I ran across this bezel kit for making bezel necklaces. So I decided to grab it and see what it's all about. And I haven't opened this yet so we're going to do this together. Now I sold bezels and glass stones at one point in my Etsy shop. I don't know if these are those glass domes or the plastic domes or it says glass so I imagine it's glass I'm not sure what we need because I haven't opened this up yet but I have a pair of scissors and an ink pen and I went through some of my scrapbooks uh, stash and I came up with this paper so I don't really have a picture or anything right now that I want to use I thought this was interesting. It looks like quilt blocks to me. So this is what we're going to put in our necklace. So yeah, let's open this thing up and see what it's all about. Okay. Here we have a template so that we can draw on our picture or whatever we're using to put in bezel. These look like stickers, perhaps. See, there's nothing really here to tell you much at the back of the box. But we do have the bezels and the chains. And it does feel like glass domes in here. So let's see what this says. Use the template size associated with your chosen bezel or tracer on your image. And we cut the image out. Pop the two stickers in the sizes associated with your chosen bezel out of the sticker sheet. So that's what this is for. Peel the backing off and center onto the bezel. Okay, so it is a sticker. All right, let's do this. Finally managed to get the bezel and the glass piece out. And the chain. Now generally, when I make a bezel necklace, I use resin, so this is going to be different for me. But this kit was, let me see, $9.98. So each one of these necklaces are going to cost $2.50 if you're looking for an inexpensive Christmas gift to make. Now we just need to figure out which one of these we would like. I picked out the small circle. For the bezel size. Okay, I'm going to decide which one I want. I'm going to use my pen to draw around it and then I'm going to cut it out and then we'll come back. This is one of the pictures that I picked out. Let's see how well I can cut this. I like this because it has like fall colors. And since all we're doing is sticking this on a sticker, and there's no actual wet glue involved, I can probably peel this out if I decide to make something different with this bezel. Not sure I'm actually capable of cutting a circle. I should have went through my punches and found one the size I needed and used a punch. Okay. So there we are. And I also cut out another one that I didn't <laughs> do that well with, but you know what? I think I kind of like that one better. So I think we're going to go with that one. Mm 
now we have to pull off the double-sided sticker in some way, somehow. Not sure how we do this. It has a cover over it because I can't feel the ends of this thing. So it must have some sort of cover over it. Okay, bear with me. Okay, the instruction says, pop the two stickers in the size associated with your chosen bezel out of the sticker sheet. Peel one side off and place the photo on the sticky side. Be sure all the edges match up. Press firmly. If need be, trim any excess photo or sticker with scissors. Now, I don't know if it's just me, but I can't pop these out. It's very frustrating. There, <laughs> there's just no such thing as popping them out. So I cut one out. That's not going to help us because now we have this whole sheet. So the only thing I can think to do at this point is cut this thing. If you have this kit and you are able to pop this out, could you please leave a comment and let me know how on earth you pop this out of the sheet. Now I think probably should have cut around the inside of that instead of the outside. Oh, no, it still works okay. Now we peel this. Okay, maybe jewelry kits are just too far above my ability. Oh wait, here we go. Okay, so this is the sticky side. That I'm actually stuck to. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Alright, now we put the picture on it somehow. Says you only get one chance at this. All right, managed to do that. Now we cut off any excess. And stick it on in there. Now I gotta deal with the sticky sheet again. Hold on. Okay, I missed a step. Now we have to peel the sticky thing off the back of our photo or whatever we're using and put that into the bezel. Then we deal with the sticky sheet again. Okay. Okay, now hold on. Now we clean the back of the bezel to make sure there aren't any fingerprints. If you're serious about this, you may want to get a little bit of alcohol and put it on there. Okay. And here is our other piece of sticky paper. It does not pop out. Did we try popping this out? I thought, wait a minute, maybe if I left it big when I pulled the first part off, maybe we could put the, the um, glass stone on it and then maybe it'll pop off at that time. I doubt it, but Let's try this. 
So we're going to put this down on this circle. Okay, so it's down. Now can we pop it? No, we cannot. So let's cut around the bezel. I'm sorry, the glass dome. This is not a bezel, it's a glass dome. You may be able to hear the rain and the wind. It's the after effects of Hurricane Ian. It's made its way to Maryland. Thankfully, we just got some light winds and rain from it. Okay. Now, I don't know if you can tell or not, but I did not put that on there very straight. You really should take your time and do this the best you can. I'm just interested on how it's all going to come together. Okay, you probably don't want to watch me struggle for goodness knows how long, so I'll be back. Okay, I believe I have it now. I'm going to peel this back off. I think I peeled up some of the sticky part as well. In any case, <laughs> I'm just going to put this on and call it a day. Sit it in place and press it down. That's quite pretty. That works well. I think it's a nice little kit for what did I say? Nine ninety-eight. And I looked on the website before I started this video, and it's on the website if you want to get it. So here is our chain that has been provided. It's just a ball chain. Works just like any other ball chain. And there we are. Not bad at all. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you're interested in this, I hope you will get the kit. You can make four of them. You have four gifts if you want to give them away as gifts. You make four for yourself. Match different outfits. Thank you so much for watching.